We're a senior design team from Biomedical Engineering. We're uh, working with Great Batch Medical on uh, coatings for their uh, catheter devices. Uh, one of the major problems uh, medically is uh, catheter-related infections caused by uh, bacteria adhesion to the surface leading to biofilm formation. So Great Batch has developed these uh, proprietary coatings to uh, so I won't get into the, it's more uh, their technology, so I won't get into how the coatings work, but basically they're targeting the second stage here we have where it's that irreversible bacterial adhesion where after this point there's no way, real way to treat the issue, you have your major infections. So what we were doing is uh, two, two kind of sides of our project. The first step was develop methods to test uh, in a static condition. So what we did was we developed a sonication method where we're exposing our samples to a bacterial solution for a given time point. We pull them out and we put them in uh, just a plain PBS, sonicate so you're removing the bacteria from the surface and then we're culturing the, that bacteria on chocolate auger plates and uh, we're counting the uh, bacteria colonies. So we saw in our initial test we saw no statistical significance but at the greater time points we actually couldn't quantify due to uh, overgrowth of, uh, on the cultures. So our second uh, work we have kind of on the side here but you can see we saw decreases for all time points with their coatings. So it showed some promise but there was a high, high level of variability just due to the uh, amount of uh, samples we had. And the second aspect is our dynamic flow chamber. So as you can imagine, in the, in the body, central venous circulation, there's about uh, a lot of high level shear flow. So we want to develop a system where they can eventually test under these dynamic conditions. And we have two uh, different prototypes here. And as you can see, connected to the pump, you can expose our samples to the condition. So any questions, contact the biomed department. They'll be happy to answer them.